This is Matrix Lord 2121. I'm reviewing the Black Cat number four. Okay, so in the third issue, uh, she robbed from Doctor Strange. Now she is robbing from the Fantastic Four. So she attempts to, she works out with her team, um, the elder guy, Fox, who wants to retire. Um, he wants to do his last big theft and he wants to rob from the, the um, Thieves Guild. Okay, um, which they steal everything. Um, so he wants to find a way to break into the Thieves Guild's um, vault, which is impenetrable by magical means, by finding artifacts or books or something that can make them open up a door and steal from the Thieves Guild because no one's ever done that. And then he wants to retire. So they plan out this theft that they have to steal this book from the Fantastic Four the book that teaches them how to open up doors. Um, this person had created a door to Kunlun. Um, so there was like a whole bunch of planning going on. There's also at the same time, the Thieves Guild had hired this guy to try to capture or thwart, uh, you know, Felicia Hardy's, you know, plans and, you know, basically stop her. So she decides to knock on the front door of the Fantastic Four's place on Yancey Street and just use her charm on Johnny Storm, which, you know, of course, he's like, you know, always the bachelor, always like he was, he was using cologne, like trying to hook up with Black Cat. But of course, like she says, like she's talking about him. He, she could see while well people, while well, like women are attracted to him, but it's not for her. Like, you know, of course, Spider-Man, she loves Spider-Man, but you know, she wouldn't probably do that with Johnny Storm because that's like his best friend and she wouldn't, you know, feel comfortable doing it. But she could play around. She was like flirting. So she basically, she was saying how there's there's two reasons like you don't steal from the Fantastic Four. And it's not Reed Richards. It's not the security. It's not the thing. But you don't want to mess with Sue Richards, Sue Storm. She will mess you up. So <laughs> that was the big thing. It's like, like the fear of God, that if you steal from the Fantastic Four, like, you know, Sue will mess you up, which I thought was hysterical. And then also another reason too, is that, you know, like, like they were, she was trying to steal the book and all of a sudden now Blastar um, came through a portal. It was like a whole bunch of things, you know, her team had taken down the guy that was trying to take her down. Um, so, you know, she was like discussing, are we gonna start robbing from Doctor Doom now too? And all the superheroes, because this is getting ridiculous. But no, they need this book. And I thought the book was very funny because it showed like Human Torch like boasting and trying to flirt with her. And she's like talking in her mind about him and the Fantastic Four. And, you know, I just found it very interesting. And Johnny Storm like trying uh, so hard to hook up with Felicia Hardy was it was hysterical. So I thought it was an excellent book. Pretty good. Um, so check this out if you can. Um well, actually, you can't, right? Because comic book stores are closed. I guess if you could buy it somehow from comic book stores, if you could order it. It was really good. So I'm going to be reviewing The Black Cat now, um, the next couple of issues. All right, guys, have a great day. Take care. Bye for now.